the format of the robot. Hey everyone. It's me, Shadow. I'm a writer and a creepypasta narrator. I'm just here to write journal entries. August 12, 2019. I just read a creepypasta called, Azumangadeo, episode 27. It was a pretty good and interesting story. I'm not done for the day though. I'm doing a stream later, and calling it Ranch Pop Tarts. After the stream. God, I hated that stream. There were so many people spamming ships. It was so annoying. There was another person annoying me though. And he wasn't talking about ships. There was a user who kept bugging me about reading his story. His name was Jacob T. But I don't plan on reading his stories, since I have many others I need to do. August 13, 2019. Well, now I want to eat Sloppy Joe's even less now. Wait, what was that? Was it, a red figure? Hey, it's probably nothing. Anyway, talking about food is making me hungry. I could go for a snack. Maybe a cupcake. Ooh yeah. I forgot. Cupcakes. After the reading. That was pretty good. Very creative. Kind of gross though. But I saw that annoying Jacob T spamming his stories again. Hopefully, in enough time, he'll- Wait, is that the red figure again? It looks like Super Mario holding a knife, and is closer. I'm starting to think that wasn't a figment of my imagination. But it's probably not after me, so I'll just go to sleep. August 14, 2019. Hmm, let's see, oh come on. I'm not hungry for more Sloppy Joes. After the reading. I'm never having Sloppy Joe sauce again. Wait, is that the spammer Jacob T again? Ugh, he's so annoying. Wait, it's the red figure again. I can tell it definitely is a guy in a Mario costume. He's on the lawn looking at me. Weird. Oh wait. He's gone now. Okay, I have nothing to add now. After doing his ranch flavored Pog Tarts video. Well, that was disgusting. I'm never getting these to eat. Plus, Jacob T strikes again with his story spamming. I'm getting so, but uh, Mario's at the door. He's gonna get, oh wait, he just ran away. Never mind. But now's not the time to think of that weird Mario. I've got my own creepypasta to narrate. They'll love my alternate episode. After the stream of his new lost episode. Ugh, Jacob T is spamming again. When will he? Someone's at the door. I'll get it. Uh, it's that Mario costumed guy. He has a knife. I'm running. I'm hiding in the closet right now. The Super Mario costumed guy just killed my sister, and now he's after me. He just said now, why won't you read my fucking stories? Wait a minute. Could the guy in the Mario costume be, Jacob T? And he's using Mario's voice? Is he doing this because I didn't read his stories? I mean, he probably wants them read but this is too far. Oh wait. I forgot about my demon form. Well, I'll just use it to eliminate him. I may be losing a fan, but it's still for the best. Okay, I just killed him with my demon powers. And yup, he was a kid imitating Mario. But my sister is still dead. And that's a run I can't write. No, just kidding. I have a solution for that. One, the manic ritual, later. There we go. I brought my sister back to life. Sure, the only possible way turned her into a demon, and permanently, and full time, but that's okay, because I'm at least part demon too. Everything worked out well in the end. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a dead body to throw in the garbage. Update. Looking back at this story, I was pretty insecure and immature. I'll just leave it as it is here, and remove the heading from before. P.S. I'm no longer Jacob T., now I'm which of Jacob's accounts I forgot.